Hey guys, um, I, welcome back to my channel. <laughs> sorry, I don't know why I'm laughing. Um, <sighs> okay, hold on. Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube ch channel. Um, my name is Serena, if you're new here, I, um, I, I recorded some of my shoulder workout yesterday and I wasn't, um, I, I wasn't gonna end up posting it for some reason, but then it was kind of funny, so I'll, I'll put some of that, um, so this is what that video was about and I hope you guys enjoy it and I'm like laughing so hard right now, hold on, I want to read you guys these text messages. Never mind. It's not even worth my time, but basically these people were... <laughs> it was so funny. Um, never mind. Okay, forget about that. Okay, um, yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video and give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and I will make... Oh, my next video is going to be all about my drawings and I'm super excited to make it to show all of you guys my drawings I do and I will see you guys later <laughs> bye okay hello again um I decided to show you guys some of my stretching routine before I bench so I like to stretch my legs too most people just like do up their upper body but um you need to do your legs for like leg drive oh ambush Sorry. Um, and yeah, and plus it makes you feel better and more limber. But I also show you guys some of my stretches. And um, I usually do this like almost, well, I do this every time I go to the gym, no matter what I'm training. But I um, stretch extra on days that I'm squatting or deadlifting. But for benching, I like to really stretch out my back, and that helps get the arch. And a lot of people say, like, how do you make your arch big, or arch, arch? <laughs> oh my god. But to help mine, I always did back bends when I was younger, and I still do them now. And um, if you don't know how to do a back bend, or if you don't really feel flexible in it, I show you guys, like, what I do to help me so you go up against a wall and you walk your um your arms back and then you put your uh it's kind of self-explanatory but yeah you just hold it there for a while and it helps really get your flexibility going on and help you get your arch okay so i'm not sure what i'm supposed to do for benching today because Mario still hasn't sent me the program, so I think I'm just going to do, um, try 90 for, um, five times, four times five or something, I don't know, I'll see how I'm feeling. Just doing 
five sets of four, I believe, at 85 pounds. Um, and I finally got my program from my sister, Samira, so now I am going to get ready for my powerlifting meet that's coming up in May on Cinco de Mayo. So I'm super excited, and I'm just going to be following her program for my main lifts, really. Okay, now I moved on to OHP. I like to do um, heavy weight. Well, even though this doesn't look like heavyweight, but it's heavyweight for me, okay? And then I supersetted that with um, upright row, upright. Damn, I should really look at these names. Okay, so barbell front raises. And I also did some barbell upright rows. I didn't film my whole shoulder workout. These are just like my favorite shoulder exercises. Um, but I didn't get to film all of my favorite shoulder exercises. <laughs> Never mind. Okay, so then I did some plate raises. These That's my favorite superset, I think. Upright rows and then superset it with plate raises. I love to go to like failure to failure on my last set or even just like my regular sets too because that's when like muscle growth really occurs, occurs when you go into failure and push yourself. I also did some rear delt um, things. These are so hard. If you ever try them out, you'll try not to cry. Um, I typically like to do one to two um, rear delt exercises when I'm doing shoulders because... Okay, yes, yeah, so very random. My gym has the most randomest things. But um, this helps get a better bench press, and it also helps with posture. Rear delts are usually neglected most of the time, so um, it's really important to do these to build up a stronger shoulder and have healthy joints. Also, you could go light on these because those are hard. Another superset that I really like are these cable um, front raises and supersetted it with this like variation of sh a shoulder press on the cable. This is my first time trying it and I really liked it. <laughs> Say hi! <laughs> okay, a tip if you're ever doing like um, a back exercise or like a rear delt, um, put your grip like a pistol grip like that that helps to engage um your back more and your lats like in a different way i don't know just try it out i feel like a huge difference ever since i did that Donna? yeah oh, okay <laughs> oh, no, <go> <laughs> okay so for the last exercise i filmed were these cable face pulls and I like to do it with the pistol grip like I showed. I didn't really explain it well, but um, Fitness IQ, he has a whole video about that. And um, yeah, it helped me tremendously with engaging the muscle groups that I'm trying to work. Okay, so that is it for the end of the video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. And it would mean a lot if you give me a thumbs up. And I will record an outro next time. I'm just sitting here with my hair wet and my dog is licking my face. Okay, I'll see you in my next video. <laughs> Bye.